Welcome, people trash. Welcome, player. I've been waiting for you. Let's get down to business. What you're about to witness is unlike anything you've seen before. It is the dawn of an era. The beginning of something and the death of many more. The wheel of events is already in motion. There is no going back now. So, are you ready? <laughs> Sorry, but you got no say here. Just keep your eyes peeled for the ride and make it through to the end. Whatever happens, this is just a game. By the way, name's Foam Gun. May this be your first step into our otherworldly domain. Let's get this party started! Break a jam! A turning point. A moment in time when you look back and wonder. How the hell did I become this? Sleepwalking at light speed, I finally caught up with myself. Have I reached the peak of all I could ever be? Am I stuck on a looping mistake? Well, I guess you found your answers. It's about time. I looked for mine. Hey, kiddo. How you holding up? Great, dude. Good to hear, cause I'm about to crap my pants. How the hell do you manage that? Yeah, years of hardship, training mind and body, and a jar of chamomile. Well, just keep your crap together. You can always bail out if things get too messy. You really sure about this? I bet you this pile of junk is worth some good pennies. Ain't too late. Come on, dude. It's for GW. He wouldn't leave us the big guy for no reason. I know, I know. It's just that... <sighs> Scrap that. Where the hell's Shade? Don't know. He said he was gonna take a leak or something. How long ago? 30 minutes, give or take. <sighs> Damn cat, man. I swear to God, I'm gonna choke that bastard dead. Crap, kiddo! It's time! Buckle the hell up, and good luck out there.
Come on, kiddo. You gotta get in there. Move that pile of junk. For crap's sake, get in range. Come to Papa Boyo. Right, kiddo. But don't lose track of your ammo. Bringing a damned gun to a fist fight, you nuts, punk ass, shameless cheater. I ain't got time to swat your damn flies. You're mine, blondie Cinderella. Kiddo, don't let this bastard corner you. Go over him if you need to. Push it away. Oh, sure hope that knucklehead's keeping an eye on his MP gauge. Else the... It smells like the god is cooking. And this is all gourmet a la Parmigiana, you tartar humper. I got a bad feeling about this. No way in hell this cardboard robot will withstand whatever's coming its way. Oh, we should have sold that piece of dirty crap before it got wrecked to hell. What a waste, kiddo. like punching with my entire body. I can feel the impact all around. Take it easy, kiddo. Don't push that pile of junk too much. Watch out for the AP gauge. Real players gotta know when to end their turn. Unless that player's a crappy dumbass. Bloody thick box! Just kidding! 
it, and I'm better off without it anyway. Now's the time your mother has eagerly been waiting for, you bloody ass punk. Chew on this, you shirtless moron. Ah, uh, the dream is over. That huge mountain of crap has been my worst gamble yet. The kid's done for. Another week of chugging down toilet water and stale dog food. What's that? Oh yeah, my cell phone. Shade? Sorry, dude. I'm kind of in the middle of something here. He ain't picking up. Pineapple's got a problem with phones. Childhood trauma. Now, if you'll excuse me. Please, mister, call him again. Please call him again. You sure you want to do that right now? It's the only time. No can do, pal. This is a breach of contract. Sue me. I assure you, this is in your best interest. We're here to make things easier for you. Think of it as foreplay. It's actually so nice of me to throw you a lifeline. So when it all goes to shit, you'll drown alone by your own fault. Last chance. Call the hillbilly and have him throw this fight. What do you say? I can't give a shit. If these are the cards you're dealing, we should- Hey, killer! Let's beat this hippie up. Why are you people always such assholes? You know what, moron? From the primordial soup to the fall of great civilizations, and now, just over the edge of the 21st century, your lifestyles have evolved in so many ways, but you people, <laughs> you were assholes back then and you're still assholes right now. Do you know what the pinnacle of human evolution is? C4, plastic reliable explosive. It fits anywhere, in any shape, almost undetectable, perfect. In my line of work, I usually expect people to cooperate, but as I've stated, People are assholes, and that's why C4 exists. For me to accomplish my fucking job. Now, where's the detonation device? Ugh, dog humor. Remind me, why the hell do I even put up with you? Psst, killer. Blow the hillbilly up. Wait, what? Pineapples? Shade? What the hell happened to your face? I fell. Into a punch? What's up, dude? First, let me brighten up your day. All I remember is that Worm God guy. God Worm, you mean. He's dead. What? Heart attack. Got nothing to do with you. What the hell, dude? I remember him coming for me and then it all went white like a flash. That was the explosion, I guess. Explosion? Yeah, seems like we've been sabotaged. Don't ever tell the dog or you're never piling again. How did that happen, dude? I might have sold your fight to some shady guys, but it's all in the past now. Wait, what? Anyway, how's it going, champ? I'm uh, fine, I guess. 
a little dizzy, that's all. Good to know. The wizard is trying his best to be worried about you, but he's also over the moon, drowning in cash, thanks to your victory. Boy, I won? Seems like it. Dude. Doc said you're mostly all right. Just a few more checkups, but you should be back in the saddle in no time. A few days or so. Where's Duke? Nurse said he was here a few minutes ago. I bet he's back with the cowboy. You know, keeping his hands busy. I better go check on him. He's not gonna like to see me, though. Does he ever? By the way, dude, how's the cowboy? A crap catastrophe! Like a truck loaded with lots of crap crashing into another truck loaded with double the crap! An utterly humongous pile of shit! Oh, I've seen my share of shit back in the day, but this? That's the most gruesome pile of shit I've seen since last Christmas! Calm down, wizard. It ain't that bad. And where the hell have you been? Checking on pineapples. He's good and all. Ready for the next one. Well, that's awesome. Except there ain't shit for him to pilot. Crap. Crap! At this rate, our winnings... What the hell happened to your stupid butt face? Don't sweat, wizard. Just do your magic. My ass. Like talking to a goddamn cat. You didn't hear shit of what I said. This is a lost cause, cat man. This piece of turd is dead. Maybe we should look for a mechanic. No way. I can screw things up myself and that's free. What do you suppose we do? Damn. Damn you, cat man. I'll fix this piece of crap. I'm gonna need a crapping miracle for it. A miracle and... Ugh. Grab a pen, you worthless piece of duck crap. Spit it. I've got a good memory. You better. Most of the hard frames and steel plates are bent and twisted. Circuits are fried, pistons dry. Secondary engines are busted and the main engine is pure poop. I need a C engine with at least 21 cylinders. Spark ignition, supercharged DOHC. Double overhead cam, dry sump. And don't you dare bring me a wet sump. This robot ain't nothing short of a miracle engineering. I'm surprised I didn't find any duct tape holding. Oh, yeah. Give me some scraps, lots of them. Screws, nails, paper clips, whatever. I need a hundred pounds and duct tape. 21 rolls, that should do it. Noted. So, what are you waiting for? Get out of my face, cat man. Where can I find this stuff? Dunno, look for a junkyard or something. to the hog's yard, trash. This is capitalism's garden, a place for trade and cash owned by a pig. Watch out for his money draining skills. I hope you two get along. I'm after an engine. Oh, what type? C. Hold your horses. We ain't talking about no car wrench in there, are we? No, this is for a mecca. A mecca? I see. Well, I don't work with that kind of stuff. Yet. 
I'm also looking for some scraps, screws, gears, nails, hairpins, metal bits. That I got plenty of. And duct tape. <laughs> you don't plan to use those together, do you? Well, what brings a fellow like you to Rain City? Who knows? Shot at a good payday, I guess. Ha! <laughs> Is there a better reason? So, you pilot one of those giant robots, don't you? Nope, not the pilot. I just manage stuff, keep things going. Hmm, interesting. Say, I got a nephew who happens to mess with this kind of stuff. He recently got a license for piloting. I'll give him a call. It'd be good for you guys to stay in touch. <laughs> Maybe we can even make some money out of it. Sure. Well, all right then. How much do you need? About a hundred pounds and 21 rolls of duct tape. Will do. Let me fetch it for you. There you go. Nice doing business with you. Uh, by the way, about that engine of yours, I might know someone who'll be able to help. Rumors say she's a witch, though, so be careful. A witch? Yeah, like a twisted hag and all. Crooked nose, black cats and crows. I swear I saw her riding a broom the other night. Anyway, I'll write you the directions. I'm no good with technology stuff. But also, while you're at it, could you uh, deliver something for me? No prob. Great. Nothing better than hard-working youth. You keep at it, you might become a millionaire, son. Uh, let me prepare the package. There you go. Send my regards to the witch. <laughs> Thanks for the help, uh, Mr. Shade. Ah, cool name, son. That's some way to sell yourself. Interesting names keep people curious. Curious people buy stuff, trust me. Well, we'll see you around. Scrapyard trash. Well, it used to be called Scrapyard before the S fell off the sign. Still, there's a lot of cats around here, which means a lot of crap is buried here somewhere. So, the name is still kind of fitting, isn't it? What brings you here, darling? I was told you could help me with a mech engine. Also, I got a package for you. A package? From who? The bounty hog. From that pig? Hand it over. Ha! <laughs> That's the best he can do. Lose a pig, bring in a pocket knife to a gunfight. Gosh, it smells like him. The hell is it? Trust me, you don't want to know. You're quite the errand boy, huh? Bringing us here, no questions asked. Well, that could be useful. Anyways, Max, right, darling? What is it? Replacement parts? You really deal with this kind of stuff? <laughs> Doesn't look like it, does it? Times are changing, honey. Now, I may have some mileage, but I still know how to ride the flow. Anything you need or want, I can get it for you. That's the ZZ seal of quality. So, what do you need? A C engine. Okay, got it. C type, 21 cylinders, supercharged. Is it a dry sump or a wet one? 
Sure thing. But I need to know what we're working on here. Got any blueprints for your Mac? Not that I know of. No worries, darling. Can I come over to have a look? No harm in that, I guess. Oh, oh honey, when I mean to harm, you'll know it. Okay, is it far from here? I'm out of vehicles right now. It's about a seven-minute walk. Not even a warm-up. <laughs> okay, lead the way, darling. What the hell is this mech? What did you say it was again? It's a P1 Gallo 07, ma'am. Call me ma'am again and you'll be the dog in my next hot dog. Sorry. This is outstanding. The way these circuits are placed, the distribution of weight, and the overall materials. No. All a piece of shit. Huh. You're yeah, better off piloting a super-sized trash can. Crap. Oh, but I've seen worse, and I have fixed worse. This guy sure is a treasure. I've never seen one in any of my catalogs, and I got them all. Now, he's pretty unique, but like they say, just because you're unique, it doesn't mean you're worth shit. You mean he's a limited edition or something? No, oh, not quite. I've never laid my eyes on a wild stallion like this one. It's probably a custom, or even worse, a prototype. How did you guys end up on a date with this? It was a gift from a friend. <laughs> a gift? What kind of friend gifts a mech to someone? The dead kind. Oh, my apologies. So, I got it. And uh, what are your expectations for this fella? Let's just say our financial lives depend on it. Well, it'll be a while before you guys can turn this garbage into a lucrative endeavor. But it won a fight already. Wow, it did? It must have been sheer luck. Or you really got an outstanding pilot. Not the latter, I can assure you. Sheer luck it is, then. Now, this kind of damage, it was not sustained in the regular sport, was it? It seems to me it was blown from the inside out. Are you aware of any malfunctions? No, there was an accident in our debut fight. Our adversary's arm exploded while striking the chest unit. Oh, I see. Now, who's the mechanic in charge? It's me, ma... Uh, sorry, uh, I'm the one responsible. I'll be working closely with you. I need a whole body scan for a detailed blueprint. After that, we can make a draft for custom parts and any adaptations needed for installing any existing mechanisms. Look, lady, we don't have that kind of cash. Look, dog, you'll have to make do. No one in the world will help you out with this piece of junk. Of course, you can do this by yourselves, but I've had a glance at what you can do, and it's mediocre at best. I don't even want to ask why this fella is carrying around a thousand rolls of duct tape. I'm seriously worried about anyone who would dare to sit in that trap of a cockpit. You should show more respect for someone else's life, killer hound. Killer hound? We'll start tomorrow. I'll need 10 grand for the blueprint, replacement parts, engine, framings, and new circuits. I'll hand you a handsome list. But... I'll send the contract via DM. Have it signed by tomorrow morning and send me a copy. All right, darlings. Let's turn this mess into a champion. So, what do you think? What is there to think? I'm signing it. What? How the hell are we supposed to afford it? Besides, that woman is a piece of work. You think so? I think she's lovely. Aw, oh, screw you, cat man. Chill out, wizard. You heard her. She's gonna make him a champion. More like she'll make a chump out of all of us. That's a whole load of cash. Think about pineapples. You really want him going through this all over again? The big guy might be a time bomb. Let's make sure Knife comes back alive. That's why I wanted to sell this crapper from the beginning. 
Let's just cash in and go on about our ways, split by three. That's got to be a unanimous decision. Pineapples isn't budging, so no deal. We got to do what we got to do. Hell, Catman, we need a second opinion. Nah, I got a good feeling about her. Witch and wizard working together. Don't you find it fitting? That old piece of hag sure looks like a damned witch. I bet she's a cat person. Couldn't you smell it on her? I got rhinitis. Can't smell for shit. Hey, glad you could make it, but if you could be so kind as to leave a comment and maybe subscribe so we can keep the lights on. Thanks.